Brentech here, where tech is made simple. So since the release of Windows 10 back in 2015, you were able to download Windows 10 from Microsoft's official website. Now, um, this is all set to change, and as from next month, uh, February 2023, um, Microsoft will not be offering Windows 10 as an official download from their website, and that starts the 30th of the 31st of January. So, um, after the 31st of January, Windows 10 no more longer available for download. Now, this is just another step that, that I think Microsoft is taking in the direction of so-called ending support for Windows 10 in 2025. And uh, um, if we head over to the Windows 10 download page, yeah, we can see this is how it currently is. That's for Home and also Pro. And here we get the new message. Uh, more about Windows 10. January the 31st, 2023 will be the last day. This Windows 10 download is offered for sale. Windows 10 will remain supported with security updates that help your help protect your PC from viruses, spyware, and other malware until 14 October 2025. And uh, um, obviously, yeah, you can click on learn about Windows 11 because the obvious story here is that Microsoft is trying to push their new Windows 11 operating system. Now, um, since uh, the Windows 10 licenses will no longer be available, uh, for purchase from next month, February. Um, they, they obviously will be pushing you to upgrade and, and buy Windows 11. Um, but if you are still running Windows 10, just take note of one thing. You will not be impacted by this change. Um, Windows 10 users will still continue to get updates um, on their PCs, their Windows 10 PCs, regular updates, monthly updates, as I do post on this channel, up until, um, as mentioned here, the 14th of October 2025, which will be the end of support date and the end of life date for Windows 10. Now, as I have mentioned previously, I seriously don't think Microsoft will officially end support on that date. Um, the market share of Windows 10 at this stage, unless something really drastic happens in the next year or two, the market share for Windows 10 and the user base is just far too great at this stage. But nonetheless, officially, Microsoft has said ending support in October of 2025. And even though um, Microsoft is um, basically ending the download of Windows 10 from the official website as of the 31st of January this month, Windows 10 licenses will still be available for purchase from a retailer. So that will be third-party retailers after the 31st of January. So this doesn't mean you'll never be able to get a copy, an official legal copy of Windows 10. You can still get that from retailers and um, other retailers online or uh, at your local uh, PC store. It just means that Microsoft um, will not be making Windows 10 for Home and Pro available through the official uh, website available for download as of the 31st of January this month. So thanks for watching and I will see you in the next one.